Welcome to Tech Brothers. In this video, we're going to learn how to add new file or project in Team Foundation Server 2015 source control using Visual Studio 2015. Let's say that you're working on an important project and it's a new project and uh, you're using Visual Studio to develop it. Um, and your company requirement is by the end of the day, whatever you work on on that project, you need to check in into a central repository source control. In my case, it's Team Foundation Server 2015. And uh, other reason that you wanted to uh, check into uh, Team Foundation Server uh, source control is that you can share um, your project with other team members that who may be dependent on your uh, uh, project. So they can go and download from Team Foundation Server 2015 direct directly to their um, local repository and start their development. How? Let's use uh, Visual Studio to um, add new project or file in Team Foundation Server 2015 source control. Here's my uh, Team Foundation server. I'm already connected to it and uh, my team project is Tech Brothers and I have a couple branches right here. So I'm going to create a new project and uh, after um, the project, I will add the project into the team TFS 2015 source control. Let's click on file, click on new and click on project. And in my case, I'm going to create a SQL server based project. So I'm going to name it my SQL project just for this demo purposes you have an option to add uh, this new project when you create it to add to source control right away uh, but uh, we're gonna uh, not select this option right now I always would like to create a project and do some work and then once my work is done then I can uh, uh, check into uh, uh, source control altogether but it, it, you have an option to uh, add click on add to source control and it'll, this is one way to add your project to uh, source control. I'm not going to click on that and click OK. And now, uh, let's say I've worked on this project all day and I'm ready to check, uh, add that into TFS source control. Uh, if you don't see your project uh, solution explorer, you need to click on view and click on solution explorer. And here's the project. Uh, right now it's empty, but in your case, there would be a lot of code here. In order to add this project to um, TFS source control, you need to right click on the project and click on source control and click on add project to source control. You'll be asked if you're connected with already with the um, a TFS um, and your team project is right here based on your permission. Uh, your projects will team projects will appear in this pan. So in my case, I wanted to check this um, add this code, this new project into my dev branch and I can create a new folder right here. I'm going to call it SQL Server and well something went wrong. Let me do that again. All right, click on this, Un unload project, and then we'll create a new project again. Click OK, and right click on the project. As I said, click on add project to source control and I'm going to select dev branch and create new folder. And click OK. All right, as you can see, there is a green plus arrow right here. That means it's not checked in. We can go in dev branch and see in the this is the new folder that I created. And if you take a look, this is the project that we just created. The green plus arrow shows that it's not checked in. So let's go ahead and check in to properly add that into our source control. Right click on the project and click on check in pending changes. Provide your comments while you're checking in and what this project is all about. Click on check in. 
and now it is added to your team foundation server source control now your other team members can open team foundation server and um, if they need to take a look or download that project to their local repository and start their development uh, they can do that i hope this video helps